I-43F, want to end my marriage after a new experience. I have struggled with what my church calls same-sex attraction my whole life. My husband has been my best friend for 30 years, and we have been married for 25. He has felt asexual for as long as he can remember. Our relationship has been one of absolute love, cuddles, and celibacy, which, while unusual, has been satisfying for us. This weekend, I attended my 25th high school reunion, about four hours from home. I stayed with my best female friend from back then. I won't go into details, but we made love several times. I experienced my first orgasms, felt desired, authentic, real, and alive. Neither of us planned for this. I'm shedding a lot of self-deception, and am determined to live my life now. I'm ready to lose some friends and family and face being unwelcome at my church. However, my best friend, husband and confidant is completely innocent in all this, and for two days, I haven't slept much. He senses something is weighing on my heart. How do I ask to switch him to just a best friend? This is tough. Thanks for listening and for any advice. Edit update. Thank you all for your thoughtful advice amidst the negativity. Many of you were correct in your assumptions about me and our marriage. Our marriage was largely to avoid the stigma in our faith associated with being single, wanting to be child-free, or being gay. We have great affection for each other, but weren't self-aware enough to realize that social pressure influenced our young marriage. We've been comfortable discussing our situation privately. We joke that we are like secret agents with our own cover story, the main one being that I am infertile. I prayed daily since my teens for God to take away my same-sex attraction, and then prayed for forgiveness for being angry that it didn't happen. My husband, whom I confided in about my struggle long before we married, has prayed beside me countless times, but has always insisted he prays for my heart to be at peace, not for me to change. That has always meant a lot to me. Our church attendance has become mostly pro forma, and I often wonder how many others are there just to be there. No, my husband isn't gay. He's funny, kind, and always helping others, a real man. He's completely asexual, and about a 9 out of 10 aromantic. No one could ever have a better friend. We've discussed in the last few years, he has brought it up that perhaps I should have physical relationships with other women to be happy, but I always shut that down. Very late last night, he told me he knew something was bothering me, that he had a feeling he knew what it was, and that we would talk about it tonight. Then he held me for what felt like forever. If you liked this video, make sure you hit the like button and comment down below your thoughts. Also don't forget to subscribe and hit the notification bell for more videos like this.